sometimes I fight needles and strings all day. My name is Gordon King. I run A1 Glove Repair. I professionally restore, restring, and break in baseball gloves for a living. Okay. That can mean repairing a glove that's a family heirloom. It could be a glove that you're using currently or your child is using currently. Uh, it could be a glove that needs broken in that you can't break in on your own. Uh, I take in gloves from people that have no use for them and I actually repair them, restring them, and I ship them to our troops because by federal law they're not allowed to take their own gloves into service. About 30 years ago, I had a very expensive glove and I needed a new string for across the top of the fingers. The manufacturer, who's an American company, would not sell me a string. They told me I needed to buy a new glove. So I found a man in Brexville, Ohio, who makes saddles. And his garbage was gold to me. He needed great big hunks of leather, and all I needed was enough to make strings. And I started that way, and now I have a contract with Tandy Leather, and they send me pretty much whatever I need, whenever I need it. I am the official repair facility for Rawlings in St. Louis. Rawlings is one of the largest glove companies in the country. And what they do is if somebody's beyond their one year warranty and, and they've called up with a problem or an issue with their glove, Rawlings gives them my name and number. And I'm particularly proud of that fact. People ship their gloves to me, both local or people from out of, you know, out of the state or out of the country. Many times people will send me different uh, shots of their glove, different pictures so that we can have an idea and give them a better quote. And then they send the glove with a payment and we set a date to get it back to them. Uh, we need to run new strings through the web. These are the original company strings and we'll put in strings that are much better, much stronger, and will last a whole lot longer. It takes us two weeks to break in a glove the way that we do it, which is unique. I heat and cool the glove, but I also add moisture to it so the heating or the freezing doesn't take moisture from it. And I'm able to break in a glove that's game usable in two weeks. I also restore the original color for free, which I do with a secret formula that I created. And you can see and also feel the difference in that. I also get gloves from people that are antiques. They're a family heirloom that belonged to someone's great grandfather. And we were able to take it, turn it around and get it to look good, but I also fix gloves so they can still be played with, no matter what their age is. To anybody, and I found out that it's not just boys or men, it's girls or women that have played ball that have an attachment to their glove. And whether they're still using it or not, they would like to get it restored in a pristine setting so that they can keep it for a memory. Somebody asked me once if I wanted to have my own glove company. I said, no, I'd go out of business. You know why? I'd make them so good that the strings would never break. Okay. okay.